A scary story by Mary Sue I'm a 22 year old girl I was looking on Craigslist to buy a couch for my new apartment a month ago I found something I thought seemed like a good deal from the pictures the couch seemed to be in great shape the seller wanted to be contacted by email his email was bigdaddy69 at hotmail.com I felt that email was a bit off putting but I still went ahead and emailed the man my offer he responded within 5 minutes it's accepting the offer and asking for my address I honestly felt uncomfortable with his asking I did not want a stranger coming to my house I suggested that I just come to his house to pick it up but he continually insisted that he come to my house eventually I stopped responding and a day later he emailed me again giving me his address I didn't know if I should go at that point but it seemed like a steal almost too good to be true and according to his address he didn't live too far so I got in my van and drove over to the seller's house. I immediately noticed that the house was a bit smaller than all the other houses on the block when I rang the bell a middle-aged man wearing a night robe answered the door he gave me a huge smile and invited me and I was immediately feeling uneasy he led me into his living room and I saw the couch immediately I saw scuff marks and small tears in the couch it was not at all in the shape that it appeared in the ad I commented on this and he just smiled and offered to lower the price I told him I'm not interested and here's where things started getting creepy as I was making my way out of the house he put his hand on my shoulder and offered to give it to me for free if I was willing to quote unquote give something to him I let out a disgusted guest and got back into my car I didn't even look up out the window I just drove away from there quickly but it doesn't end there that same night I was laying in my bed watching TV when I thought I heard somebody stomping up the steps of my porch. I muted the TV and was able to clearly hear the sound of somebody fiddling with my front door knob. I jumped out of my bed and took out over to the front door to look through the peephole but whoever it was was already gone and then I thought I could hear the sound of the gate to the backyard opening and closing that was when I grabbed the phone and dialed 911 soon after I heard the sound of somebody fiddling with the doorknob to the back door of the apartment I yelled to whoever it was that the police were on their way and after that I heard the sound of the gate opening and closing again they were gone this was a month ago and nothing has happened since but I still can't sleep at night I'm 99% sure it was the man that was selling the couch he must have followed me home there's no way it was just a coincidence I don't plan on using Craigslist anymore and I'm still trying to find a new apartment